everyone, my name is Angel and today I'm going to be doing an unboxing of the September Nerdy Post. Nerdy Post is a bookish and fandom subscription box that comes with like, I don't know, six or seven little goodies, not one that comes with a newly released book, but it's just bookish and fandom inspired knickknacks. I got the September one because I found out the theme was going to be Pixar and DreamWorks. And as soon as I heard Pixar, I was like, I'm sold, take all my money. I think it's gonna be worth it. And I'm excited to see what other boxes they come out with because I've really liked the ones that I've seen in the past on YouTube. Also, I had the pleasure of meeting Alexis at Nerdy Post and her husband, really nice. I met them at Booknet Fest and I got to chat with them for a long time. It was really nice to meet them. Thank you guys for taking the time to chat with me. And now let's check out what's in this September Nerdy Post. This is the print that talks about everything that is in the Nerdy Post on the back. I see a couple of bookmarks. This one says, this is Dream Crusher. He protects me from having unrealistic goals. And the other side says, she had one terrible problem. She was filled with curiosity. I really like this side. This side is from The Crudes and then this side, I believe, is from The Good Dinosaur. I have not seen either one of those movies. I am so ashamed. I really need to check them out. But I really love, love the way this is done. It's so pretty. The next bookmark says, crying helps me slow down and obsess over the weight of life's problems. And the other side says, oh boy, this is going to be good. I can tell. These are both really pretty. And they are from Finding Nemo, which is this side. And then of course, Inside Out because it's sadness. Finding Nemo is from An Artist Has No Name. And then Inside Out is from Sasha underscore Natasha. I think these were just designed by Alexis at Nerdy Post and they are both really pretty and I can never have too many bookmarks. I mean, right? Who can? We also have, I believe this is a coaster. It says, you kids are gonna grow all kinds of plants, vegetable plants, pizza plants. This is from Wally. I have not seen Wally in so long. It has been a while, but I love this. It's so cute. And I love coasters. I'm like so weird about them. I can't wait to use this. So we have a postcard that you can color in and oh my gosh, you can like actually send it. That's so cool. It was hand lettered by Drop and Give Me Nerdy. This is so cute. I can't wait to color this. I might, I don't know if I'm gonna send it to anyone. I might keep it for myself. We have a print. Of course, adventure is out there. I don't even need to look. It's from Up. And then the other side says, no dream is too big, no dreamer too small. This tells me it is from Turbo. I really like this. This is really pretty. I might like alternate and then switch them out. I don't know. I love this. Then we have, I think this is called a fat bookmark. One side says, get up and fight like a girl. The other side says, I'm not giving up today. There's nothing standing in my way. If you knock me over, I will get back up again. Get up and fight like a girl is from A Bug's Life. Oh my gosh, I love that. It was created by Indigo underscore 11. The other side is from Trolls. I don't know who that's created by. Might be Alexis. Then we have a couple of stickers. These are really cute, of course. I mean, I'm sure this one's Monsters, Inc. And then this one says, reach for the sky to infinity and beyond. Um, Toy Story, maybe? I love these. I like putting stickers on my wall, so I might do that for these. They're so cute. And then we have this little pin, which I totally need to get a denim jacket so I can use like all these pins that I've been collecting. This is from How to Train Your Dragon. I also cannot believe I haven't seen that. I clearly have so many movies I need to watch. Toothless Tail, designed by her at Nerdy Post, created by Lapel Yeah. So that's so cute. I like that. And I don't think you have to know that it's from How to Train Your Dragon to like appreciate this. I think it's like cute and spooky-ish and I like it anyway, even though I haven't seen the movie. I saved the best for last because this box is Pixar themed and my favorite movie of all time is The Incredibles. I bought this box because I thought there was a chance that they could include something of The Incredibles because honestly, The Incredibles is so underrated. And when I met Alexis, I was very pleased to find out that I would be happy with this box and I am. So the last item is a poster inspired by The Incredibles and I'm going to hang this up so soon. Never look back, darling. It distracts from the now. By the glorious Edna Mode. Look at this. I just, I'm in awe. I believe she created it. Alexis and Nerdy Post. And I love this so much. The colors are like the theme of the Incredibles. This hand lettering is so phenomenal. Oh my gosh, I love this so 
much. I finally have something really cool from The Incredibles. I'm so excited to put it up. Thank you for including something from The Incredibles, my favorite movie of all time. 15 years is too long to wait for a sequel. So that is everything that I received in this nerdy post box. Yep, we just got some bubble wrap and then an empty box. So that is everything. I am very satisfied with this box. I think all the designs are really, really cute. It's really well made. It looks like great quality. And I'm really happy that I subscribed to this. That is Nerdy Post for you. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know what you thought about this box. I hope you guys have a great day, whatever day it is. And I will see you soon with another one. Bye.